Hey there everyone, this is Zagal playing Mega Man 2 and a half Dimensions. Apparently co-op mode has completely leveled different... Wow, I said that backward. Has completely different levels. I mean, I'm going to be playing solo mode, so I'm not going to be experiencing that, but it's cool to know that this game is secretly two games. Uh, after the power of the snake, we venture into the shadows due to the triple, well, double Mega Man 3 representation. He can be Proto Man, but this name's, game is named after Mega Man, so we're going to play as Mega Man. That's just logic. Oh my gosh, it's a ninja! You can tell by the ninja star, that's part of his head. Oh, it's interesting how the world creates itself. So yeah, this is the classic Shadow Man start. Classic eyeball, classic falling down. Watch out for the lava. Oh man, watch out. There we go, look at that frog. It is now exploded. Construction work, it's pretty ridiculous. A lemon on a floor. Well, this fight graphic is new. I don't know how to interpret this. Flip run around. Destroy people all around. Oh, you are a slow gliding man. Having fun. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you jumped on me. What a rude thing to do! Uh, Alright, and then I'm gonna do a mighty leap here and- Oh, wait, you fall? Okay, well, you watch out, there's a pet! I could not help them. I guess we're not gonna fight Proto Man, considering he is a playable character. Unless if you play as Proto Man, you get to fight Mega Man. Like, I guess that could happen. They pretty silly. There's something about this lava here on the floor that I think I love. Uh, is there more Yoku? Or is those two? Okay. So it's just... Then, oh! Well, it's not like it's dangerous to get, though you do have to do jumps. Alright, so... Three... Yeah, I want that one up. One ups are good. Alright, there you go. I'm back to the normal amount of lives. Uh, not punished. Eyeball man... Oh, that's all. Alright, there you go. It's a spike, you know? It has colors and other colors, too. That guy is driving a truck. There's a pit there, I think. It's kind of hard to see. It's a grenade! And here we are in this giant, vast lava warehouse. Nothing going on but a vast, giant room full of lava. Don't question it. It's fine. Well, see, here the treatiness is interesting. We can, like, see more upward. It's kind of neat. All right, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna, like, whoosh. Dragonfly! Gonna shoot it in the face. Alright, the old bridge hop, Mega Man staple. I guess here you don't need to do it, but you can. I guess it's fun. Uh, three track lightning. Here we go. Rock! Yeah, that's right, you blew up. That you feel real proud of yourself. I need to hit you, but I'm not. But you gave me health back, so nothing was learned at all. Oh, there's a giant yeah, green block. Okay, that's just weird. Just Hi, I'm Giant Green Block. How's it going? I like to hang out here in the shadow shaft. <laughs> How about you? Oh, this is kind of a scary jump. Whoa. And then here, it's kind of a blind block, but it doesn't matter. Look at that, it's a grenade man. Uh, in search of search man. I'm glad that it doesn't seem to be the darkness gimmick, but is that a Mario World type snake? It sure is, kinda. More like a skull raft, looks like. Alright, yeah, it's lava. Look, I've said in the description yesterday, this game has powerful ROM hack energy, and stunts like that really contribute to it. I love it though. Like, you know, remember, I, I love ROM hacks! I love playing ROM hacks, so this is super my jam. Watch out, it's a frog! Whoa. Uh, watch out, it's a warning sign. A falling Mega Man zone. So, I guess it's a war- Oh, shoot. Gotta hurry up here. All right, whoosh. Here we go. Kinda hurry up, though. But that was Scaro. Alright, another falling Mega Man zone. So you gotta hang on to the ladder. Then that froggy's gonna hop in my blaster. Oh, that's sad. Alright, there you go. Big pit. Everyone, be careful about the metric volume of traffic. Well, I don't have the means to destroy you, don't I? Can't grab you. 
and the snake is ain't hungry. That's unfortunate. I don't have the explosive mode. I don't know what's the explosion weapon in this game. I got just barrel shot. My like, there's not like Crash Man or Bomb Man or anyone like that. I don't think. Oh, whoa, whoa, there, Mr. Truck, going towards me, pretty rude. So every level has an E tank. This is this one. I can't get it. Oh my gosh, it's Shadow Man, the Shadow Man with a shadow plan. So he hops, he slides, he hops, he slides, he hops. I miss him. Whoa, he, he, he saw blades, ninja stars. He hops, I miss. That's what we do. Yeah, there we go. Well, I heard a ding there. Did you deflect me somehow? He hops, he slides. No, he didn't slide. He threw his ninja star. They're giant. They're not very stealthy. <laughs> oh, whoops. Whoa. There you go. I wonder if it's best. No, see? I'm willing to spend a life here. It's fine. Like, I'm okay with that. I know I have an E-Tank, but, you know, if I... See, this is my regret when I use my E-Tank against Quick Man, is that I could have just lost a life and tried with a full health bar. And not have to use the E-Tang that way. Ugh. Shadow Man always been a bit tricky. Because, you know, because like, you, you can't predict him, you know? He's a ninja. Because, like, what you gotta do if he's gonna throw a ninja star or if he's going to slide is different. I guess the trick is you wanna be on the other side of the screen as much as possible so you can see it coming. But that lowers my DPS, though! And then it can slide under his star. Oh, boy. Yeah. Whoa, like that. I say, not demonstrating anything. You know, like that. Oh, wow, whoa, that did a lot more damage than I thought it would. Uh, like, I thought I was safe in terms of health? I guess not. Alright! Look at that. He's blocking. He's got his fist down. Ready for action. Uh, all right. Well, here we go. Shadow Man, Shade Man. Sh Shade Man's a vampire. He's not a ninja. Different things. I'm sure they have a shared history, but strictly speaking, different things. It's when he gets here, it's like, okay, so there, depending on what he does, will I be able to react? I don't know, man. Don't worry about it, I guess. We'll worry about it a little bit. We'll worry about it later. How about that? Well, if he gets that close, see, it's like, hmm, well, it's pretty close. Ninjas are known for not having great personal bubble respect. That is true. That's why they were hired for these kind of shenanigans back in the day. No one else would get that close to people. There you go. So I use my e tang because of you. You are now part of the Quick Man Club. I bet you're really proud. I bet being part of Quick Man Club is actually pretty good. Like, he's a pretty infamous guy. Yeah, if you're gonna be part of a club named after a guy, I feel like Quick Man is pretty alright. Unless talking about your cheese! You don't want quick cheese. I think that's just a fact. I doubt it! I defeated Shadow Man. He's a ninja. So he hops around and slides on his butt. He has giant blades he throws. Wow, I got pink and purple. Oh my gosh, that me tools flying and the rocket helmet. Gonna see a demo of the Shadow Blade. That was the demo of the Shadow Blade. It's like Metal Blade, except kind of bad. I mean, that's pretty much it, isn't it? Like, isn't that pretty much it? A little bit. I don't know. Don't worry. 